Bye, guys. You've just finished the um, uh, Hoover Dam Madison Leviticus uh, tour of the UK, and uh, for, did you enjoy it? Yes, it was uh, very interesting, um, mainly because we did the Raptors album, and that's never been done before. And I, in fact, I'm not even in the Stranglers did we ever play those songs in the uh, consecutive order of the way that they are were on the album. So uh, we played them, obviously, but not not exactly in that order. So it was the first time I'd ever done it, and it was very odd. Especially doing the songs that I've never sung before. So there, are, there are songs on Rattus that have never been performed live. No, they've all been performed. They've all been live, performed, but um, but there are songs that I'd never sung before because I, I'd never, um, some, was... I never sang them ever before. Yeah. Uh, Ugly, Princess of the Streets, and uh, London Lady, and uh, I suggested Caroline sing Princess of the Streets because I got a lot of guitar bits to do, so I thought it would be better, and I'd also I could take a break. <laughs> Did, did Caroline enjoy seeing that? I mean, she's, she's never sung so. lead vocals before. Yeah, it's the first time she's sung lead vocals, and I think she had a good time. Yeah, I think yeah. she did a great job. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so, I mean, you know, you're talking about doing the album in order. I mean, do you, how well do you know that album? When was the last time you played it before you decided to uh, play the songs like that? I a mean, long time ago. So, so it, it, it probably it didn't feel that familiar to do them in that order? No, not at all. Well, it, was brand, it was like it was playing something brand, like it was playing something brand new because of the, for that reason. Mm. Mm. Novel. Um, it was very novel. Yeah. Uh, you were very vocal um, about um, fans not using flash photography during the shows. Why Absolutely. is that? Absolutely. Well, I'm I'm a bit like uh, I don't mind photo people taking photographs. I mean, you know, we've given away the album, so I'm not worried about uh, copyright and stuff. It's just that. When a flash goes off in the audience, there's so many things I've got to remember, I've got to c keep my concentration, so many things, is that when a flash goes off, I know where it is, for one thing, so I think, okay, there's a flash photo I've been taking over there, and then I start thinking, when is he going to do it again? And it just, it destroys my concentration, and uh, nearly every time it happens, without fail, I either messed uh, some, some lyrics up, or I messed a cue on my guitar or something. So it's, it wasn't doing so my... I was always I'm thinking of the audience, sure. ultimately, because sure. because I wanted them to get the best show, and, and the only way to get the best show is to have no flash photography. And, um, you know, some people may think that's silly, but um, it, it just, that's just a fact of life. Um, so uh, it was a great um, tour and uh, a, great, um, a great success. Uh, and a great way to end the year. Um, so what are you going to do um, over Christmas? Uh, what am I going to do over Christmas? Well, it's my sister's birthday on Christmas Day. So she always has a bit of a shindig. Yeah. So um, I shall be taking part in that. Great, yeah. great. And so 2010 looks like it's going to be a great year. I mean, uh, is it, is there any plans that you have that you'd like to talk about? or? Um... Uh, well, there's lots more touring plans going on. Yeah. Uh, and people might have noticed that we've immediately uh, thrown in uh, some dates in May uh, 2010. Other cities, but doing this Hoover Dam Rattus double bill thing, because yeah. uh, the demand was so good for the tickets. So uh, we're, we're, we're going to do that, uh, which will be good fun. And uh, we're just putting the final touches to uh, uh, a second trip to America in the last uh, six months because there was one in September but we didn't then we couldn't go across the whole country so this time we're going to start in Texas uh, and then work west and then hopefully go around and touch some of the places that we uh, touched in September for a second time and then um, hopefully carry it around in a, so we'll end up back where we started in Texas right, right. Um, so there's that uh, very close to being completed now, yeah. and um, and uh, any any new places? I mean, I wonder if the you know if the free download has um, opened some new markets, maybe some yes, foreign speakers. Well, it on. has. Yeah, yeah. We're 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 that we're just uh, again um, penciling in dates and things for um, to go to South America, uh, but that hasn't been finalised yet. Everyone will know. It's, I mean, the best place to look is on the website. That's the place where the things get confirmed. Um, so it's worth looking at that quite regularly. Yeah. Uh, uh, so South America, um, Argentina, Brazil, and Peru, right. which I've never been to any of those places, so that's going to be good fun. And um, and also uh, to go back to a place I haven't been to since the days of the trains, which is uh, Croatia. 
there's uh, some uh, we're talking to some people about going back there in the uh, in the late after America. Because the Stranglers, the Stranglers made a few visits behind the Iron Curtain because Croatia yeah. was part of Yugoslavia in those days. That's right. Yeah, we went to Yugoslavia a lot. Yeah, yeah. really. Yeah, and you yeah. also, did you not go to a place like Poland and other places in Eastern Europe before? No. Czech Republic? Banned from the Czech Republic? No, but I I went to the Czech Republic and played there on their um, Velvet, the celebration of the Velvet Revolution because right. it was the opening of the um, Speaker's Corner there. Right. Yeah. That must have been amazing. Yeah, and they pulled the plug on me. Why? What, what did I you say? They were too loud. I didn't say anything wrong. No. I, but I, they said, you are too loud. <laughs> I switched my amp off. Wow. What can you do? What can you do? Um, so, well, South America and uh, some of Eastern Europe will be fantastic in 2010. Yeah. USA know, I, and Canada. I think that um, there'll be more and more um, uh, 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 inquiries coming in, which is seeing more and more. So, uh, so that's good. Uh, and uh, there should be some news about uh, my book as well uh, in the spring as well, which right. is quite nice. Um, I wanted to ask you about a book that's come out called uh, The Hoover Dam Companion. It's um, yes, it's not an official book, but um, but, what, what, but you, must, you must have seen it. And I have. What do you think? I'm very impressed with it. Um, uh, yeah, a chap called Chris Wade is a bit of a fan, and I've since met him, and he's a lovely chap, uh, very capable. And um, it was this thing completely came from him, and that's why there's no. I didn't do anything. I had nothing to do with it. It's not official at all. But um, I do approve of it. I've seen it, and I approve of it. I think mean, it's great. But uh, but it's not official. It's it's. I had nothing to do with it. Cool. The Hoover Dam Companion. It's called. The Hoover Dam Companion. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds like something to do with Regis Digest. <laughs> it is. It is like a Regis Digest. I mean, I th yeah. I mean, the interview with Caroline is great, and there's all kinds of yeah. Stuff in there. I think there's a few things missing in it. I mean, there should be an interview with Chris. I mean, the drama, my God, so third of the thing. But yeah. uh, anyway, you know, it's a good. It's a good start. Yeah. 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 No, that's no, no, I can walk off now. I can't.